Hi guys, good morning. Today is Wednesday, April 29th, 2020. And today we are going to continue with Unit 7. Let's see here. Grammar, indefinite pronouns. Last class, last video, you got a presentation about this topic. Let's continue. This information is from your student's book. It is on page 122. Indefinite pronouns. Remember, we use them to talk about people, places, and things without giving details. Let's look at the example. Look at the chart. Someone has painted a mural on the wall of her school. I think it's great, but not everyone loves it. In this example, we have everyone and someone as indefinite pronouns. Let's look at the other example. If you can think of anywhere to visit this weekend and you've got nothing else to do, why not come to the arts festival? You can see public art exhibition everywhere. In this example, we have anywhere, nothing, and everywhere. <clears throat> we use every and one. Every one. Remember, these are compound words. Someone, anyone, and no one. Every and where. Everywhere. Somewhere. Anywhere. And nowhere. Every and thing. Everything, something, anything, and nothing. Let's continue with exercise 29. Remember, these exercises are on your student's book, but you will also find them in a Word file. Choose the correct option to complete each sentence. Let's look at the first one. I don't think anyone or someone should paint on public buildings without permission. So in this exercise, what do you have to do? You have to circle or underline the correct indefinite pronoun. In, next, in the next exercise, exercise 30, Complete the text with the correct indefinite pronoun. You have here a text where you have to complete by using this chart. 